Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. A thin prism of angle 6 degree and refractive index for yellow light and y 1.5 is combined with another prism of angle 5 degree and n dash y is equal to 1.55. The combination produces no dispersion. The net average deviation delta produces by the combination is 1 by x degree. The value of x is fill in the blanks. And this question is asked J mains 2022. Now, from the diagram, here two prism combined together such in a way there is no any dispersion. What does it mean? Means they are not splitting in their seven color. They are only deviate. This rays only deviate means change its path. Is it okay? And here, first prism, the angle is given 6 degree. And second prism, their angle is given 5 degree. Here, mean color, refractive index of mean color means yellow. That is, NY is given 1.5. And for the second prism, the mean color, refractive index of mean color is given 1.55. And here, net deviation is given 1 by x and what is the value of x? Is it clear? So here, we have using basically two conditions and the dispersive power. On this concept, here, clearly we can see that there is no any dispersion means their net dispersion, suppose the dispersion of first prism, that is theta and for the second, theta dash. There is no dispersion means resultant 0. Is it okay? So here what is theta? Here theta means angular dispersion that is A mu V minus mu R. Is it okay? So here substitute this value for the first prism dispersion A mu V minus mu R plus a dash for the second prism the angle of prism that is a dash mu dash b minus mu dash r is equal to 0 then a mu v minus mu r is equal to and transposing to the right side become negative minus a dash mu dash b minus mu dash r is it okay now here, what is the formula of dispersive power? Here, the dispersive power is delta upon theta upon delta. Theta upon delta means dispersion upon mean deviation. Dispersion that is, it means A into mu V minus mu R and A into mu Y minus 1 for the mean color. Here, A, A cancel out. So here, dispersive power omega can be written as mu v minus mu r upon mu y minus 1. Or it can be written as omega into bracket mu y minus 1 is equals to mu v minus mu r. So in the place of mu v minus mu r, we can substitute this value. And why we have required? Because mu v and mu r is not given in the question. So therefore, we have required to convert in the form of dispersive power. Is it okay? So here A and what is the value mu V minus mu R can be written as for the first prism omega here mu Y minus 1 is equal to A dash omega dash mu Y minus 1. Here given that is N Y that is the same things. Okay. So mu Y or N Y that is a refractive index. So here A for the first prism given that is 6 omega 
and what is the value of mu y here given that is n y same things 1.5 minus 1 and here second prism the angle that is given 5 degree omega dash 1.55 minus 1 here negative sign only shows that the direction of this second prism is inverted so therefore here negative sign can be neglected is it okay so here omega upon omega dash 5 degree 1.55 minus 1 that is 0 0.55 and here 6 into 1.5 minus 1 that is 0 0.5 so equalize the decimal after decimal for 1 2 so only 1 applying 0 and decimals cancel out 5 tens are 50 and here 5 1 the 5, 5 1 the 5, 5 2 the 10, then omega upon omega dash equal to 11 by 12. This is first equation. Okay. Now for the net deviation is equal to deviation for first prism and deviation for second prism. Then deviation formula of deviation a into mu mean color minus 1 and uh, plus a dash mu dash y minus 1. Okay. So here a mu y minus 1 get common that become plus and here 1 plus a dash upon a because we have taken out a common and mu y minus common so therefore mu dash y minus 1 upon mu y minus 1. As we know that here for the first condition for net dispersion that is 0. So theta in the place of theta a mu v minus mu r is equal to minus a dash mu dash v minus mu dash r then uh, mu v minus mu r upon mu dash v minus mu dash r equal to minus a dash upon a okay so in the place of a dash upon a we have substitute this value a mu y minus 1 in the place of a dash minus a we can substitute this value here minus we are using here okay so minus mu dash mu v minus mu r upon mu dash v minus mu dash r into bracket mu dash y minus 1 mu y minus 1 clear so here net a mu y minus 1 1 minus here it can be rearranging mu v minus mu r upon mu y minus 1 upon here mu dash v minus mu dash r upon mu y minus 1 only rearranging because this is numerator and we have to put in denominator this is in denominator upon of upon comes the denominator so now it become a mu y minus 1 1 minus omega this is dispersive power omega upon omega dash now substitute all the values uh, what is a angle means first prism that is 6 degree 1.5 minus 1 1 minus here we have already find out omega upon omega dash that is 11 by 12 so here 6, 1.5 minus 1, that is 0 0.5. This is 12 minus 11, that is 1 by 12. So 6, 1 the 6, 6 to the 12. So 0 0.5 by 2, decimal remove, 0, 5, 1 the 5, 5, 4 the 20. So here comparing this term, 1 by 4, so x equal to 4 is correct answer. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video.
definitely when you will become success full contribution goes to your hard work but if my videos my lectures my questions will help in your success i will consider myself lucky please like share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students thank you once again take care bye bye